in any of this, any of my statements. I'm not speaking for anyone else. Um, when we actually viewed the video, that changed the game for. I mean, I had, I went into that deliberation room thinking one way and watching that video sealed it. For me. What were you thinking initially? I was thinking towards the plane up. Um, I really did. I, I believe his, bio, or his privacy was violated, and um, that, that was that's not okay. So the video was worse than you expected. The video was worse than I expected in, in some sort of context. Not not so much the sex part of it, but just the the conversation. I just feel like if he knew that he was being videotaped, he would not have spoken about the things he spoke about. So. The racial connotation of the video. Is that what you're referencing? No, no, that wasn't no, in the video. video. Yeah. No, I don't know anything about that. So. What was the, the language that you were putting? Just, just the conversation that was going on between him and, and the woman in the video. Um, it was just, it was very human. And if you're going to be video, videoed, you would not be talking like that. Can you if you knew. Your name? Oh, sure, Selena. Uh, Can you spell it for us? Sure. S A L I N A S T E E N S. How old are you? I'm 35 years old. What do you do for a living? I work for um, campus safety at a college, local college. What would you say was Gawker's most compelling case? I mean, was there was there a point in their defense that uh, persuaded um, you at all? You know, no, there wasn't. Did, I mean, were you sympathetic frankly, at all to Gawker? I was. I tried not to be sympathetic towards either side. Honestly, you know, there's not room for that in the courtroom. That was made very clear to us as jurors. There's not room for this, and so. Um, you know, we tried not to be sympathetic. Obviously, we're human beings, and it's a little bit hard. But when we sat down, we really did check each other on that and say, you know. So. Now that this is over, what's your overall impression of having a journalist? Has it changed your opinion? No, it hasn't changed my opinion. I still have no interest in them, so I never have. What do you hope will come from this case for other media and for Um That, you know, I understand that we have a First Amendment, and I stand behind the First Amendment, but. Um, I'm in front of a ton of media saying this, which is intimidating. Um, I, I don't want that to be used improperly, and I think that it is used improperly way too often. And, um, you know, we, ha we also have privacy laws, and I hope that those will be taken into more consideration when stories are being ran. You're probably not aware of this, but there's been a great deal of discussion that this case could well be reversed on appeal, or the damages could be substantially reduced. Do you have any thoughts on that? No. Um, Sure. <laughs> uh, I think obviously, you know, we we knew that that was part of our discussion. You know, we don't, we're not naive. Um, we're talking about a lot of money and a lot of people who did not think that they did anything wrong. So um, it is what it is. There, you know, there, I don't really. I guess I don't have a lot of. I hope wherever it goes that they can kind of continue on the path that we set because I really hope that we have laid some groundwork for. For those things, for the privacy to be more, you know. So. so it sounds like you didn't buy the argument that Gawker made, which is that uh, Mr. Balea had already made his uh, his sex life an issue of public concern. No, I didn't. Not at all. Uh, there's a difference between. Um, first of all, I believe he was in panic mode when he was talking about those things. Uh, obviously, there was times he talked about it when it wasn't centered around this, but um, but that's just my opinion. And then I also. Um, there's a difference in speaking about it or writing about it, and there are problems with the video, and and my problems with the video. So, yeah. Nick Denton for that guys. Punitive damages theory as told to the jury, exceptionally grateful. What can we say? They did everything we asked, they vindicated Mr. Belaya. How you feeling? How you feel, Hope? I feel great. I'm really happy about everything that's happened, and uh, 
I think we made history today because I think uh, we protected a lot of people from maybe going through what uh, I went through, so we're very excited, very happy. Can you talk a little bit about the support you've gotten or seen from the community? I know you're on Twitter, and what are you seeing from people? Well, the community knows who I am, you know. Uh, my WWE family knows who I am. They've been very supportive of me, and at the end of the day, it's just nice to get back to normal with all my family and friends in the area, and it's just, it's been unbelievable. Everywhere I go, everybody, everywhere I show up, people treat me like I'm still the champ, and they've been very supportive, so it's really cool to be in this community and feel the love from everybody. Did you ever expect to see this kind of a judgment from this jury? I didn't know what to expect. Oh, it was only the right thing to do, folks. Of course we did. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. I told you I was going to put out another one. Thanks, Ralph. Thanks, Ralph. Take care, man. Oh, okay. Well, I can let you go. Totally. Oh. Um, but so what did you think? Did you think that he was gonna win the whole time? Yeah, like yeah. two weeks ago when I went in, I'm like, he's gonna win. What made you think that? Uh, just the people, they, they didn't really seem too honest. Uh-huh. And... Gawker didn't? Yeah. Okay. So I was like, oh, he's gonna win. Sure. So had you ever met him before you came out yeah, here? He's yeah, my, he's my childhood idol. Okay, okay. Yeah. I'm coming. Uh, Jason, I'm coming. She's interviewing us. Okay, Jason, J A S O N. Yeah. Last name? W I L T. W I. Don't take oh the D on there. W I L T. L T? Yeah. And how old are you? 38. 38. Okay, and what do you do? Um, <laughs> photography. Okay, that works. It's true, right? Yeah, you're, hey. Awesome. Your photos okay, are great. He's, he's All right, thank you. <laughs>